Queen DJ and in today's video I will be reacting to viewing to episode 3 of season 3 of Izzy Water Rabbits. Rabbit. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. It's a little too loud on my ears. Yeah, because it's like 50. Oh god. <laughs> mm, she read about that though. Bye, Chino. Hmm? Yeah. Exactly. Let her broaden her horizons, get the information she needs, and then let her pick. See, I feel like because the fact is we're going into like a high school-esque life for her. We're probably going to see her in a high school uniform and she's going to look so fucking cute because it's Chino and Chino is cute in anything that she wears. She could wear a paper bag and she would still be cute as hell. <laughs> I mean, it's true though. I still want that figure of Chino, like, with her magical girl spoon and everything, because she looks so damn cute. But do you know how much that figure is? That figure, I think the last time I looked on Amazon for it, I think it was about $200, I believe. I'm not 100% sure. I mean, because, like, there are a lot of figures I want from this series and then, like, other series that I'm into. And it's just like, oh, you find a good price, and the next thing you know, you check again two days later, either one of two things. It's gone, or they raise that price up, and you're just like, mm. Mm -hmm. But, you know, you want to go to the same high school, like, as Mayo and Megu, right? Have you? Now that's just, um, Gold Prince is pretty here in a nutshell. <gasps> yeah, Maggie's definitely gonna be like that. I mean, she is really proper, so... <laughs> It could sound like paradise to her. And besides, it'll be fun. Yay! Maya, you possibly not ready to go to high school, babe? I get that. I mean, we all understood that.
sex museum as a kid. Huh? <laughs> I can't. Are you serious, though? Thank God it wasn't picked. <laughs> up to you baby no you'll, you'll do fine it'll be okay i mean you handle a cafe and if you can handle that which we all know you can you're gonna do fine at this oh it's okay poor baby Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, that makes more sense to get more customers. Can you imagine, like, if they had a 3D printer and they made, like, a 3D version of it? Oh, <laughs> uh, God, that would be so cute and hilarious at the same time. And watch, somebody's gonna do that. <laughs> She did. <laughs> oh my god. Mm, good question. Because I was about to say. Your school ain't pancakes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like what's her face from um Endo? Even though I never finished Endo. Yeah. <laughs> Be really funny if Aoyama showed up, right? Aoyama. <laughs> you 
gonna have her come out. She's right about that, though. Mm-hmm. When you first met Gaga. <laughs> Yeah, but then at the same time, Aoyama is lazy. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> yes, aka why she is best girl. <laughs> Aoyama is probably just somewhere chilling, procrastinating, not her ish. <laughs> the fact that Whenever Aoyama is in here, she's here. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, it's cute. Can we just say that she literally sounded like Shadow? I mean, oh. <laughs> Probably. I mean, because it is a really pretty school and you can get distracted very easily. I can't even imagine if, like, freaking Cocoa or <laughs> she came to this school. Oh, there she is. Mm. Well, no, babe, you're the one who's lost. Or maybe you guys should just go back to where you were supposed to meet her. Oh, dark club. Oh, this. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll find her. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh, you you think she would just stop? Exactly. There we go. <laughs> but it, it, yeah girl uh, okay well we're gonna see you in a uniform oh my god even though she still looks adorable in her middle school one, but like, baby about to be mature. Look at her! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Cutie patootie. I think so, honestly, because if she really did, she wouldn't have, you know, freaked out as much as she did. <laughs> like the anime version of Mean Girls and it's so cute except they're not mean they're just cute and nice
Mm -mm. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's good. You found Liz. They were talking about Liz. Uh. <laughs> you know, Chino can't say no to tea time. <laughs> and then there's cake, too. child <laughs> you guys never had bing sprouts well yeah cause they are rich girls Did neither of y'all know that there was a tour today? I mean, oh my god. I mean, hold up. Like, look, they get to take ballroom. Oh my god. This school is amazing. I would go just to go. I mean, ooh. What Coco at school give you? <laughs> Honestly, yes, you have. <laughs> What's up, Shadow? You're doing good. No, 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 no. <laughs> I straight. Yeah, forward. Right there! Right there! Right there! <laughs> if only they opened their eyes. There we go! <laughs> well, y'all, <laughs> you didn't ask. <laughs> Oh, really? And I think this goal would be perfect for her, I'm just saying. Our tomboy will, like, you know, be born into a beautiful butterfly. Plus, you'll have Shadow and Liz here. <laughs> well, I think that's it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> She's right, though. Oh, isn't 
Isn't that what you want? Mm-hmm. Honestly, yeah. I mean, they could have transferred, like, in season one or season two. Speak of the devils. <laughs> for an episode. <laughs> she looks like Nozamine and I love that because Nozamine is my favorite muse girl. I love her so much. Just look at her. Oh my god. <laughs> You're pretty. Mm -hmm. This was a cute episode. Like, hella cute. Wasn't imagining that it would have been nothing but just... Them going to a high school and giving a tour and everything, but it was cute. Like, oh my god. And everybody was there at the end of the day, no matter what. But it seems like all three are going to go to the same school as Shadow and Liz. You know what? I'm okay with that. I think if um, Maya and Megu had gone to both Shadow's and Liz's school and Chino had gone to Chia's and Coco at school, I think they would have felt some type of way. Like, they still would have had that bond that they have. I just think eventually, like, they would have possibly drifted apart because of the fact is, yes, they go to two different schools, and sometimes you can't always have that time to hang out with everybody, but still, they would have made it. They would have always been like, yeah, we have time for each other no matter what. they just so fucking cute, and I'm dead. Like, oh my god. This episode was too adorable. Everybody looked so freaking cute in this uniform. Like, oh my god. Huh. <laughs> if they don't release the figures of them in this uniform. Like, oh my god. Seriously. Like, oh, because they're... As I said once again, there's so many figures from this show with these girls that I just freaking want. Like, they had figures of these girls in, like, um, fruit dresses. And it was... Oh my god. So freaking pretty. I was like, I that, that's a need. What the hell with the foam art? That's a need. That's a want. Just so freaking cute and adorable as hell. <laughs> but really, I have nothing else to say. It was a really nice episode. Um, but still, it would be nice if Chia and Coco had the time to be able to get, like, transcripts to be transferred from one school to the other. But because of the fact is, I'm guessing, you know, from their families, they don't make as much money, even though they both have jobs. So, like, not only from their own personal jobs, but then, let's say, like, from their family, they were getting money. Um, then, yeah, I would say let them transfer so that everybody could all be together and we could just see, like, them in adventures every single week, even though we're seeing that now with this show. But, you know, it is what it is, no matter what. I mean, yes, like, <laughs> at first Coco was feeling some type of way, like, Chino, you have to come to my school. My school's the best school. And sometimes it's like that because, you know, um, it's just when you're choosing a high school, like, here... Where I let no, I'm gonna I'm gonna talk about my Nebraska experience. In Nebraska, when I was in middle school at the time, and this was around before I moved. Um, usually, from what I've learned here in America versus stuff in Japan, here in America, it depends on like where you live, um, in the state of like 
Florida or the state of Nebraska or the state of New York or Washington, well, Delaware, ish like that. Wherever you live in like the smaller towns and stuff, there are like districts or, um, yeah, districts in a way. And let's say your middle school, like my middle school was named Logan Fontenelle. And down the street from Logan Fontenelle was Bellevue, Bellevue West, I believe. And East was like, no, East was down the street from my middle school and West was like 20, 15, 20 minutes away from my house. And so sometimes like with that, it really just depends on where you live. But with, um, with Tokyo, it's completely different. I think you can, you're able to go like to any high school that you want to go. But of course you have to take an entrance exam. I mean, it, it's interesting. I mean, like if I had the chance, if I could ever go back in time, <laughs> if we could, but we know that ain't real and that it ain't happening. But if we ever had that chance to go back in time and just to like, have that moment or that experience to be a high schooler again and if I was like hey if my dad was like we were moving to Japan and I got to see that experience and deal with that I think that would be a really good thing I mean mm, it probably would have been fun but yeah I mean you know whatever Mayu, Megu, and Chiyo choose it, it'll be it's gonna be good no matter what I mean both schools are pretty. I mean, one school is kind of prettier than the other because one looked like a freaking museum. I mean, let's not get started on freaking um, Love Live Nijigasaki and freaking D4DJ and their schools because both their schools look like freaking museums. I'm like, what is y'all budget for y'all school? I'm like, how are y'all doing this? Like, explain. <laughs> But other than that, guys, that was my reaction view towards episode three of season three of Is the Order a Rabbit? If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode four. Bye, guys.